Hey, so you might be wondering why I'm doing this announcement, especially if you're at the center, you're probably looking at me over here, standing right here, but there's a reason why. The reason why is this, I tend to get emotional when I talk about the subject matter, and I wanna make sure that we can put this out to the live stream and to our social media posts so that there's a lot of clarity around this process. As many of you know, in June this year, I announced that I would be retiring, or at least I'm starting to plan my retirement, and we would move into a succession plan. The Board of, Tr Board of Trustees and the search committee have been very active in this process, and the application process closed on September 30th. On September 30th, we then resumed the search committee and looked at all of the different resumes, and we have narrowed it down to three different candidates. The process will be like this. A candidate will come in on a Tuesday into our valley. On Wednesday, they will do a Wednesday night service, which I'll explain a little bit more in that. And then on that following Sunday, they will join us and the candidate and myself will do pick a page. So you'll be able to see the candidate do a, a, a standard talk, and then you're gonna see how they do on their feet. I strongly encourage you to attend the Wednesday night service first because this will be your opportunity to see in totality with an entire music team this person's program. They're putting the entire program together for that evening for you. This is your opportunity to see who will be the future leader of CSL Palm Desert. So I encourage you to be here. We're gonna have a buffet or a, a pasta dinner or something before each one so that we can have a sense of community at 5.30 and then at 6.30 on those Wednesday nights, that's what's going to happen. So plan on being there. Thank you. On October 23rd, Wednesday, October 23rd, there will be a pasta dinner here at the Center for Spiritual Living at 5.30, followed by our first candidate, Charles Hall. Charles Hall comes to us from Seattle. He started out as the, uh, the Seattle Center for Spiritual Living. He did a stint at the Agape Youth and Family Ministry. He did a stint at the headquarters for the Youth and Family Ministry. And then he founded a church called Genesis in Seattle. He is our first candidate. He and his daughter are coming down, his six-year-old daughter. And I know it's gonna be a wonderful evening. Uh, I can't wait for you to meet him, for you to hear him, and to experience Charles Hall. So Wednesday, the 23rd, be here, 5.30 for dinner, 6.30 for the service. Charles could be your next spiritual leader. We want you to see him. Please be there.